met the Aesthetica crew at the Wangle Tangle 2010, one of their jam format competitions, to learn more about their snowboard design called the Gruba Libra. The Aesthetica Gruba Libra exists uh, since probably uh, now six years already. The, this is the sixth season. Actually, the first two years we had a design from our really close friend, Michi Gugarel, who did a very nice job, simple and uh, very beautiful. Just perfect to start off. The second year, uh, we stepped it up with one of our closer friends and snowboard buddy, uh, Lucas Goller, who did an amazing design, you know, really nice. Uh, the year after, we went with uh, Will Barris, who did an extraordinary board, uh, one of the most flashy ones I saw like so far in snowboarding. Uh, then the year after the permanent unit, permanent unit actually joined at the circle of designers in uh, the aesthetic air line or the Gruba Libra line and they did an awesome job. And uh, yeah, this upcoming season we got uh, Ferdl from the Atzkerai in Vienna who did this amazing board like well, I'm just like super stoked and blown away by, by how the way it looks and uh, yeah, I think it's a beauty. Huh? So the relationship between Steve and the artist is very close so that they all have the freedom that they need. What they do, that's up to the, the artist and uh, that's I think quite important for us just to leave the artist the uh, free space so he can uh, just go and paint a nice picture and feel free. As free as Steve Gruber feels himself when he uses the boards the artist designed for him. Of course, we met the designer of the new board as well, Fertil from the Atskarai. Steve called me then one day and asked me if I'd be interested. He came through me to me through my collective, which is the Atskarai from Vienna, based in Vienna. We're five five guys doing illustration, graphic design, and all this stuff in Vienna. And he asked me if I'd be interested in doing his next board. I was like totally, totally into it. Doing like, like since since a kid I wanted to design snowboards and skateboards, so it was like a real cool job. And so I met Steve. We talked about the project, and we had that idea of, of that heart coming on the board, which should um, image the, the the passion of the riders from the Aesthetica crew while they're riding. And it's obviously inspired and by my other job, being a tattoo artist, so it's a bit like tattoo flash style. We had did that, we talked a lot about the project and we came out with that design and I'm, I'm super happy with it. I hope Steve likes it as well. People who see Steve riding, for example, they love his style and of course, it, it's even better if he has like a snowboard which looks cool and awesome and people are also like, oh, it's not just his style, but it's like the whole thing goes hand in hand in a way. And because board sports and art does go hand in hand, the permanent unit and the Atskarai were special guests at the Aesthetica Jam, the Wangle Tangle. You know the writers, but it's cool to know where the art is from because the art is like a big thing with the writers. You know how they dress, how, they, how, how the boards look like. It's cool to get to know these people, they deserve it, like we get also paid like most of the time really shitty with this stuff. We have to work our asses off, it's like a really passionate thing. So I think it's just, just cool and fair to involve those people as well. And that's exactly what the A-Boys do. They invite the artists to their contests and let them design boards and the trophies for the winners. 
For the Aestheticers, it's all about style and freedom. 